In this video, I'm gonna show you how to get a custom Discord invite link without being a Discord partner and without having a level three boosted server. So in other words, 100% for free. But before I show you guys that, a quick shout out to the sponsor of today's video, WAP. WAP is a platform that allows internet entrepreneurs the ability to monetize their Discord communities. With WAP, you're able to set up your own storefront where you can sell multiple different levels of access to any of your Discord servers. Your store will then be listed on their community marketplace where you can grow your server organically and users can leave reviews on their experience experience with you. Check out WAP today via the link at the top of the description. And if you want to learn more, feel free to check out my full length video going over everything with WAP that I'll also have down below for you. Thank you again to WAP. And now let's get back to the video. So like I mentioned right now in Discord, there's two different ways you can get a custom invite link for your server. The first one is being a Discord partner, which is very hard to do. Even if you meet all the requirements, it's still extremely hard to do. Trust me because I've applied many times and got denied every single time. And then the other way is to have a level three boosted server, which requires 14 server boosts. If you're subscribed to Discord Nitro, then you get two server boosts for free and you can apply those to your server. After that, you do get a discount for being subscribed to Nitro. So your boosts are only $3.50 per boost but that adds up to be quite a lot. But luckily for you guys, I have a perfect way around that and that's with discord.io. You guys might've seen this in my description before because I've been using a discord.io link for a long time now. Basically what it is, is it's a redirect link. You link, you get an invite from your server, a regular discord.gg link, and you link it up to discord, to your account on discord.io. And what it does, if you use my discord.io link, discord.io slash gesture, it's just going to redirect you directly to discord and let you join the server. Just just like that. It's that easy. So the way we're going to set this up is we're going to come up here to the top right and we're going to click log in. This is going to let you log in with Discord. So make sure you're under the right account. Just click authorize. After you do that, it will say you have been successfully logged in. Once you sign in, all you have to do is come up here to the top right and click add listing. I'm going to give you guys a heads up. This takes a little bit to load for some reason, at least for me. I don't know why, but there we go. It took about 30 seconds for me to load it for some reason, but you're going to be taken to this screen. Now, you guys that are just joining this site aren't going to see this. This is my already existing link discord.io slash gesture to my personal server. Um, and that'll basically show me uh, how many times it's been used. And it also shows me from where people are using it and on what device. So like uh, Android device, Windows 10, and the country that they're from. So to actually set up your custom link, it's extremely easy. All you do is right here where it says custom alias is type out what you want people to type in after discord.io. So for example, my current one is discord.io slash gesture. For this one, we're just gonna do gesture with an extra E. After you do that, all you have to do is grab a permanent invite link from the server that you want people to be able to join. So we're gonna come in here to my old server. We're gonna go up to our server settings. We're gonna go to invite people. We're gonna edit the invite link to make sure we set it to never expire because it needs to be a permanent link. We're gonna generate a new link, copy that link, come back over here to discord.io paste the link and then personalize. And then it's gonna take a second. You might get a weird error and you have to refresh. That's what I just had to do. I got an error saying that it wasn't, I was only able to do one per server. If you do get that, all you have to do is refresh and then you should see your server pop up right down here. And now if you wanna test it out, you can click this link down here or you can copy it to your uh, uh, clipboard. Come up here, paste it enter it in and it's going to redirect me to the server that I set up, which is my old server. And that's how easy it is. It's just as fast as a regular discord.gg link. You may have an extra two seconds for it to do the redirect, but it makes for a really clean invite link and it's 100% free. It's uh, definitely worth checking out. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to drop a like on it to help spread this to others. And if you want to keep up to date with everything discord, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the future content. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.